All right, guys, we're here at the Understand and Measure Volume Quiz. Go ahead and hit play to start. How can we find the volume of this fish tank? So we count the number of one foot cubes shown in the picture. So I would only count these. Well, that wouldn't give me the volume of the entire fish tank, right? That would just give me the volume of these blocks here. Would we find the number of one foot cubes that filled the tank, the entire tank? Or would I find the ones just in one layer, just this bottom layer? No. Right, the volume is what would fill up the entire thing. So we want to figure out how many cubes would fill the entire tank. Click next. This box can be packed with 48 unit cubes. If I was to fill this whole box, it would have 48 cubes in it. The edge length of each unit cube is one meter. What is the volume of the box? 11 cubic meters? Well, the cubic meters part's right, but the 11 isn't. 11 is just the blocks that are right here not the blocks that would fill up the whole thing. 48 cubic meters, well, if it said I had 48 cubes, that's right, and we're in meters, that's right. 11 meters, nope, it's not 11 and it's not meters. Remember, it has to be cubic because we're using three uh, measurements, or 48 meters. Nope, we're missing the cubic part. So 48 cubic meters. Carla packed this box with one centimeter cubes. What is the volume of the box? So to find the volume, we're gonna calculate the length times width times height. So we're looking for three measurements, right? So first we're gonna need the length, which is one, two, three, four. My width, one, two, three. And my height, one, two, three, four, five. Four times three is 12 times five, 12 times five is 60. So you would type 60 in, and then you have to select your units, which remember we're looking for cubic, right? Cubic units, so we need cubic centimeters. Centimeters here, cubic, because we multiplied three measurements. Click next. Evelyn packed this box with one inch cubes, which expression does not show how she could find the volume of the box? Well, let's see, how would we find the volume of this box? If I was finding this volume, right, I would do length of two times my width of three times my height, one, two, three, four, five, six. So two times three times six works, so that one's good. Would two plus three plus six work? Two plus three is five, plus six is 11, that doesn't work. Two times three is six, six times six, that works. Or if I add up six plus six plus six plus six plus six, plus six times, right? That would also give me 36. So if these three work, adding it does not work. We want the one that does not work in this case. Find the total number of unit cubes that fill the entire prism. So if I was to fill up this entire thing, right, they're showing us just some of the cubes. If I was to fill this entire thing, what would, um, what number of cubes that I need? So I have one, two, three, four, five, six here, times one, two, three for my width, and one, two, three, four for my height. I'm gonna do the numbers I know easily right away, right? Three times four is 12 times six. 12 times six is 72. So I'm gonna go ahead and put 72 in here. Click done. 72 unit cubes would fill that entire shape. The base of this solid crate has an area of six and the height is four. So what is the volume? So they already calculated this area here, which takes away two of our measurements, right? If we're doing length times width times height, they told us the height is four. The area is already done with length times width. So we just need to do six times four. Six times four is 24. So I'm gonna type my 24 in here. We're using meters and remember they must be cubic. So cubic meters, meters or square meters, they're cubic because we're multiplying three numbers.
Next question. Find the volume of the prism. So we need to do eight times two times five. Eight times two times five. I'm gonna do my easier numbers combined first. Two times five is 10. 10 times eight is 80. So I'm gonna put 80 cubic units in here and click next. A shipping crate sorry, is packed with unit cubes. The length of the crate is four, the width is two, and the height is four. Find the volume. So they said it's four times two times four. Four times two is eight. Eight times four is what's left, which is 32. So type in 32 cubic units here. Click done and next. And you're all done. We'll be back with practice, understand, and measure volume. Have a great week, guys.